Dear you, I'm concerned, so, so I'm writing this letter because I'm better with words. It hurts to see you so confused and stressed, especially because you say that you do what you like best. Dancing. Dancing is supposed to be fun and joyful, right? But joy and fun were pushed aside. Something else is on your mind. It's in your head, it's frustrating and it's bad when your whole being is reduced to this one question. Will they like you? Scared child occupied your body and mind. And scared child wants to stay alive. No wonder so many kids try to kill it and slay it. And they talk about dance. Such strange expressions. Dancers instead of dancers look like assassins, possessing invisible guns, acting like thugs. Click, 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 a million hits by kids, all thirsty for more blood on a dance floor. Kids are skipping originality. It's such a pity they look so alike. They just look fancy, smart, they dress the part, they act the part. But do they dance the part? Or do they fall apart? No foundation, no solid ground. How do you expect to dance like your favorite YouTube star? Here's a question. Do you dance to be admired by other dancers? Do you dance for comments like Oh my God, whoa. Or you do it with some swag and flow for that amazing inner feeling when you let yourself go. And just how low can you go if you think you'll only glow? if you get picked for a select group. <laughs> or you reach 100 likes on Facebook, whoop de boop So what is the answer to will they like you? Will they like you? They. Who are they? Skill critiques behind the screen, controlling your self-esteem? When are you going to realize that you are full of potential, one of a kind, special, unique? That your message is relevant and strong like your physique with your body you speak? Your body. Four limbs, but thousand stories you can tell with it. At the end, I hope you understand, this is just what I think. That's my stance. And I haven't written it for you, it's for me. Just to remind myself why I dance.